Hello everybody and welcome to the Meadows for a crucial matchup in this season. Both squads three and six, we have the Mallards and Gators. Huge playoff implications on the line today. Yeah, it really is basically a playoff series here. You call it a play-in on the NL side of things, but not necessarily gonna be the three seed here. You could fall into a two seed potentially, but the winner of this series will most likely be moving on. In fact, if a sweep occurs today, that team will actually clinch a playoff spot. So huge series. Um, for the Mallards today, we have myself, Caden Irwin and Trevor Bonham here. Davenport is here as well, kind of serving as a sub, but um, it's been our core three of news in all year. Uh, I have faith in my guys, and I'm, I'm excited to get playing today. I know um, we've, had, we've had our ups and downs this year for sure, but uh, I've been having a good time, and we've put in a little work since last series, so uh, who knows, just we're looking to get some wins. And the Gators have their core three again of Cheatham, Jorgensen, and Zerlag. They hit three grand slams and still lost that series against the Magic. It was a really mind-blowing stat to me. However, Jorgensen did get his first win on the mound this year. And Cheatham's looking a little bit better. Zerlag, too, is having a, mm -hmm. a better Absolutely. year at the plate. Three home runs, I think, on the season. And this Gator squad had their way with the Mallards last year. They beat them 3-0. If you guys remember, there was the Speedgate series, all that whole phenomena. But if you take a look at the standings right here, they, of course, are both 3-6. and six. If you get a series win today against the other squad, yeah, I mean, you're, you're, you're looking really good heading into your, your final series of the year. But if you get swept, I mean, I don't know what to tell you. I think I think it guarantees the Mallards are out, right, if, if yeah, you get swept? because we yeah, the Eagles beat us. So if we get swept, we're out. If we sweep the Gators, win the playoffs, the Gators aren't technically out yet, but either way, a sweep is huge. And it's time now for some player interviews. All right, Brendan Jorgensen, your second time playing the Mallards. What's the feeling like in this Great Lakes Gators dugout heading into this series against a, a, a team you played in a game last year where it was very controversial? You know, I think uh, there was a lot of positives to take out of our last series against the Magic, so, but I mean, I think we really just gotta throw the rest of the year out, out in the garbage, you know? Mm -hmm. This is our wild card series right here. We need to win this series if we wanna make the playoffs and get back to that World Series, so it's it's do or die right here. All right, so last video I said Baranowski would have a breakout series, which he did, I think. And I'm calling the same for you today, Caden. So what needs to change for you guys to get back to your winning ways here for the Mallards? Uh, I think first is defense. Tom and I are going to clean it up a little bit today, help out Trevor, and then I think getting uh, some good at-bats on these guys, make the pitch count go up, um, see a lot of different stuff, and get more ABs. Huge series today. Let's go. All right, here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Mallards versus Gators. Grounder, fair ball back to Trevor. Two pitches, one out. Very quick at bat. What a pitch from Trevor Bonham, strike three. Shot to right field, right to Tommy Coughlin. The flip, got him at first. One, two, three. Go the Gators, bottom looking solid. Bottom one, we go. It's gonna be a ball four to lead off the first. Here's another one, into right field. Zerlag flips the first, got him. Moves bottom up to second. Irwin will try to bring him in to break the tie. Boy. Ball four, first and second. Just missed low. The bases are juice for Tommy Coughlin with only one away. Fair ball, back to Jorgie. Fielder's choice, two away. Full count on Irwin. Got him looking, strike three. On the bottom pipe, he gets out of a bases loaded jam. Jorgie locks in, and no runs come across. We're going to two in a scoreless game. Woo wee! All right, let's get it. Fair ball, back to Trev. Oh, bobbled that first fair. Cheatham beats it out. Swing and a miss. The pitch from Trevor Bottom. One away. Shot in the center field, very hard hit. It's just gonna be a single though. Zerlag is putting the ball in play a lot this year. Not sure if the average entirely reflects that. He's getting robbed a little bit this year, but that's a hard hit single. Swing and a miss on a riser inside. Speed warning, official, 73 miles per hour on that pitch. Swing and a miss. He's compliant with speed. Way to bounce back, Trevor. Gator Strand two. And we're going to the bottom of the second. Mallards will look to break the tie. 
What a pitch from Jordan. Look at that drop ball. I'm putting a replay on that. That thing came down hard. Oh, nasty. Oh, what a pitch. That is so hard to touch. Jorgie's dotting him. Ooh. Lost him. Great eyes from Caden. Here comes Trevor again. Slider. Strike three ends the frame. Scoreless going to three. Got him looking, strike three. Swinging a shot to right field. Not enough right to Tommy Coughlin. Two away. Pops to bottom, makes the play. Retires the side nicely. And the Mallards will look to walk it off in game one. Still in a scoreless game. TC3 will lead it off. Played straight up. Swing and a miss on the drop ball after a long AB. What a slider. Strike three. Two down quickly. It's up to bottom. Need to keep this inning going or else we're going to extras, folks. Inside ball four. Long at bat. Had him full count. Coglin gets another opportunity. Took some off, drop ball, strike three. We're going to four. Free wiffle ball in a crucial series. And the playoff atmosphere is living on. Zerlag to begin the fourth. Shot to left, to right. Let's go. Gone. Oh. Brendan Zerlag, solo shot, first pitch of the fourth inning. <laughs> Jorgensen's loving it. I had a mental blunder, said it was to left but it was to right. They're like stomps at home. The Gators lead the game 1-0 here in game one. Career year for Zerlag continues. Shot to left, to right. Let's go. Go. Let's go. Looking. Tipped into the zone. Strike three. Two away. Grounder fair back to bottom. Can't handle it off the shoe. He's safe at first. Three for five on the day. Out of boy Zerk. Swing and a miss. Got him on strikes. Ends the frame. However, the Gators break the tie on a Zerlag home run to right field. And the Mallards will try to tie it up or win the game here in the bottom of the frame. Slider. What an eye from Caden Irwin. That is beautiful. The leadoff guy is on. Always a great sign in wiffle ball. Got him. Oh. Look at strike three. Keep your head up. Come on, One away in the fourth. Keep your head up, Patience. birds. Here we go. Into left field. Cheatham catches it. And he doubles him up. The Great Lakes Gators win game one on a double play. Cheatham does it himself on the line drive to left field, snags it, catches Irwin off the bag, and the Great Lakes Gators are sitting good. Four and six is where they stand. Mallards need to do some work. It's do or die time now for them. Game two coming up. What a way to end that game. Got the Mallards versus the Gators here. Gonna be a tilt. Both teams, backs against the wall. Swing and a miss, got him on strikes. What a pitch, pinpointed on the corner. Strike three. Swing and a miss, good riser, tailed in. Jorgensen solid again in the first inning of game two. This is the best I've seen Jorgensen. Everything's working for him. The Mallards are turning to Caden Irwin, who will now be pitching. Shot to left field, that one is gone! Chris Cheatham, solo shot, chucks the bat. And that is huge for the Gators. One nothing in the first. Chris Cheatham locking in.
on the drop ball. That thing is filthy. Grounder, fair over the base. Brendan Zerlag, another hit today. What a series for this kid, and it's only game two, first inning. Pitch, two away. Swing and a miss on the drop again. Irwin changes the motion, catches Jorgensen off guard. Mallard's got a lock in. Season could potentially be on the line here. Rise up. Got him oh. on the corner again. Zerlag and Cheatham loving it out there in the outfield. Oh. Jumping out there synchronously. Just silent. Good at bat from Tommy. And way to leave. Way to leave. That's tempting to swing at. First and second out with the Mallards. This is big. Just one away. Swing and a miss on the riser. Up the corner again. Jorgensen locking in. Two away for Coglin. Swing and a miss. He got him chasing. On an outside slow slider. Jorgensen now makes it five consecutive scoreless innings in the series. He is looking really good. Shot up the middle, look at Zerlag. What a day he is having. Grounder back to Caden Fairball, throws to first, textbook, moves Zerlag up. That's how you draw it up. Shot to left field, over bottom. He can't make the play. Of course, there's no force at three. Smart base running from Zerlag. Could have stretched it, but he plays it safe. The Gators have a threat going in the second. One away. Grounder fair! Zerlag again! Base is loaded! I've said it so many times, but this is a career day for Brendan Zerlag. Another hit. Six on the day. Shot to right field! Gone! Chris Cheatham grand slam! That could be the dagger. Gator chomp. Zerlag stomping. There it is. This kid is locking in. Oh my goodness. This might be the best I've seen the Gators all year. You have Zerlag getting a ton of hits. You have Jorgensen locking in on the mound. And Cheatham now with two home runs on the day. Let's go! Let's go! There you go, that's a firm slider. Lost him. Got it. Strike three, ends the inning. Gators now with a comfortable 5 nothing lead as we go to the top of the third. And folks, it is now time for the BL 101 trivia question of the day. And I'm not gonna lie, it's a difficult one. Name all three of the AAA 2018 teams. <laughs> all right, it's the Gators, the Dusters, and the Grizzlies. If you actually got that comment below. Strike three on a slider, on a full count pitch. Jorgensen on one today. Ground ball, hard hit to the left side. He's safe, no throw. Trevor Bonham, the first hit on the day, I believe, for the Mallards. To right field. Zerlag under it, makes the play, two away. Close but no cigar for the Mallards. And we've got a pinch hitter here. Brendan Davenport into the game. Ball four, Davenport draws another walk. Two plate appearances in his career, two walks. This game is not over. Here's Bonham. Got him, strike three! The Gators win the series with one game to play. These Gators are looking like the best I've ever seen them. They are rolling. All three guys are playing their best wiffle ball. Mallards now really need a win in game three or their playoff hopes are gone.
Mallards need a win in this game three. Here's Bonham back on the hill. Swing and a miss, firm riser, K. Fair ball over the base, Jorgensen. With a shot to left field, he's gonna stretch it, a double for Brendan Jorgensen. Look at that speed. Jorgie's racing around first. Oh boy. Pitch from bottom. He went. He got him. What is he swinging at? I think Cheatham was anticipating a riser coming up in his own. And that will do it for the frame. Look at that pitch. That was a diet super curve. Grounder fair. And he misses. Davenport safe at first. And he gets back in time. Look at Davenport. Three plate appearances in the career, and he gets on base each time. <laughs> Super curve, he broke it out. Four strikes. Three. Swing and a miss. That's gonna do it for the inning. And I'm gonna do a little substance check. Hold on. What is that hanging out of his pocket? <laughs> Clean towel. Please wash today. Some spider tech? Huh? No, no spider tech today. He's clean. <laughs> Thanks, man. I swear we are cheaters. Shot to left field. Jorgensen single. Oh, Brendan Zerlak. Shot. His historic day continues. That one a two run home run, and the Great Lakes Gators strike first again. 2-0 in game three. Mallard's on life support. Good Lord. That's his best day ever. Oh, good pitch, Trev. Strike three on Chris. Ooh, popped up. Makes the play. Strike three. As we trying to get some pictures for Instagram. That'll end the inning, and we'll now go down to the field for a very exciting mic'd up session. Who's on, Mr. Schultz? You're leading off. <laughs> The top two. Shot to left field. Third ball. Jorgensen single. Say foul ball. I said third ball. Uh, I just heard the all. God, the bugs are terrible. <laughs> I know. I'm getting eaten alive. Who's mic'd up? Who's the goat? They mic me up. Oh, shot! Go! It's a bomb. It's the seventh hit today. Yeah, he's swinging bat. Should I give my World Series predictions? Yeah, let's hear it. Wildcats, oh. Diamondbacks. <laughs> be a good series. Wow. That's what I want. That's a good one. That would be a really good series. How would you describe your whiffle ball game for your uh, your, pins, your appearances in tournaments? Uh, we pitch well when we get Bill out there. Bill Price. What? He's our he's our golden boy. We battle. We don't. We're no easy outs. Marty puts it in play. I, Marty. I put it in play. You got to play to beat us. Bill Bill keeps us in it. Shout out to Bill. <laughs> Shout out to my guy Bill. Two down, two in. That's three. Did you enjoy that? Awesome. <laughs> Pitch from Chris Cheatham. Drop ball. 
Got him. Strike three. Davenport K's. There you go, Tommy. Hard ground ball to left field. Safe at first. Coughlin's first hit of the day. Irwin's the tying run. Mallards need a spark. Swing and a miss. That ends the second. 2-0 still is our score as we head to the third inning of game three. So we missed strike three, one down. Grab ball, fair, back to Trevor. Bobbles, got it at first, bang, bang. Way to, way to bounce back, Trevor. After the bobble, flips it to Davenport over there at first base. Makes the grab, and we have two away. Swing and miss. Bottom finally. Dust, Zerlag. And the Mallard season comes down to this. In the bottom of the third, they need two to keep the game alive and their season. Crop ball, fair to the right side. He's out at first base. Zerlag steps on first, gets him. One pitch, one out in the third. Missed up. That's what they needed. The tying run comes to the plate. One swing of the bat will tie this game. Swing a shot, but caught by Zerlag. He missed the peg. Oh, that was just like game one. However, Zerlag missed the peg. Oh, Zerlag could have just ended it there. And that could have been the series. Swing a shot, but caught by Zerlag. He missed the peg. Oh, that was just like game one. Now let's have another life. Irwin now will be the hitter. Good eye from Caden. They're still alive. First and second for Trevor Bottom. Two out still. Come on, Trev. Come on, kid. Popped to cheat him. That will do it. The Great Lakes Skaters sweep the Mallards. The Mallards become the first team ever in MLW to miss the playoffs twice. The Gators improve to six and six with the sweep. They are now tied with the Eagles. Mallard Nation, the ball did not fall your way today. Shut out three times from Jorgensen twice and Cheatham in game three. That does it at the Meadows. Alright folks, that was that was the best I've ever seen the Great Lakes Gators play, I'm not going to lie. Um, all three guys were on their games, Jorgensen was lights out on the mound. You had Cheatham and Zerlag raking at the plate. I'll go to Jorgensen first. Um, what was the difference today? Why were you so on point against these Mallards? Uh, I don't know. I think I just kind of fed off the last series. I felt a lot better on the mound last series. I gave up a couple runs, but you know, today I was just locked in. I mean, I gave up some walks, but I was able to get out of the jams. So I think that was big for me. And then Zerlag, this might have been the best you've ever hit in this league. Just talk about your day as a whole. Uh, likewise, like Georgie said, you know, I think we were all just dialed in. We all knew after that last series we had to get something going. You know, this is the Gator Wiffle Ball. This is carryover from last year. You know, we're all swinging. Defense mm -hmm. is playing good. Pitching is pinpoint. Can't ask for much more. And then Cheatham obviously had some big home runs again today. And, you know, you get a sweep. You're tied with the Eagles. What does that say about your squad? I think we have a lot of resilience here, you know. It was uh, a tough first half of the season, but, you know, last year we really were awesome in the first half, and then we stunk it up in the second half. So, you know, why not put another good half together this year? Hey, don't let the Gators get hot. I know as good as anybody, if you, get the, if you let this team get hot, they can go all the way. So it should be very interesting to see how they progress in the second half. But thank you guys, as always, for watching the video. Subscribe in that corner. See the last video from us in that corner. All the links in the description, including Patreon, merch, podcasts, really anything. So go check it out. Thank you for watching.